Today, someone just uploaded a video of him using this crazy bounty hunter bug to stack hits on his opponents. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, he just got nuked! Not a bad haul. The guy who uploaded the video, his name is Clipper. And he and his friend are waiting for targets to come nearby so they can stack them with a Fire Surge and Karasi special. Oh my god! Dead! 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 Oh my god! Again! 85 mil! <laughs> 85 mil! Ooh, okay, this one is for a little bit more money. The Karasi is such a fast weapon that hits 100% of the time. So with big enough hits, literally anybody can die from this stack. He's dead, he's dead. Yes! 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 254 mil! 254 mil! What the fuck? A quarter billion PK for 10 seconds of work. Lesson learned, don't enter Bounty Hunter with anything you aren't willing to lose while this bug is still out. Seriously, someone could 4576 stack you on the same tick. Scary stuff. And Clipper is working with Eliop, who's streaming live. Darok or something? <laughs> what do you guys think? Will this get patched? Will the people responsible for employing this tactic get banned? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Personally, I don't think they'll get banned, but really, who knows? And welcome to RuneScape Chronicles. Banked is pretending to be a noob with his dragon mace and granite plate legs. How is that fair? Glad I'm fighting this weapon. That guy didn't see that coming. This week's update fundamentally broke RuneScape. Am I not noticing the movement animation when running? This, what? Diagonal pathing broke. What is that? <laughs> it's gonna be fun. Oh, this is gonna be good, bro. Oh, man. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is so weird. What? It seems the butterfly is still working. This one, where as you can see, instead of going diagonally, it kind of like goes like this. This is actually just visual. This doesn't actually matter. It's just annoying. Uh, but I can recreate right here. Look at this. Look at Tunky. He's standing still. If I click on him and then click this right after, wait, gonna, like, first up, then I just literally cannot move to this tile. How is the two mechan side running? It's probably going to be really fucking bad. Some people simply weren't bothered. It doesn't stop me, bro. It does not stop me. I'm still going. What a gamer. It does not stop me. And Skillspex's bank decided to stand up for itself after years of manipulation in a toxic relationship. Why? 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 why bro? Why can't I open the fucking bank? The hottest moment on many players' minds is the bounty hunter boosting and how it's now a bannable offense. But how do players feel about it? I find it kind of interesting that it's straight up bannable. I don't like boosting. I wish it didn't happen. But banning does seem a little extreme to me personally, although it is, you know, the integrity of the high scores. I love that BH boosting is finally bannable. It, it's probably going to motivate a lot more people to grind. I do wish that the people that did boost either get the armor taken away or the points off the high scores or something. Well, the only way off the high scores is to be banned. So maybe you're in luck. Yeah, they would have to make sure they're actively monitoring it. It's the same thing with Infernal Capes too, right? They do a ban wave to scare people, but then after they don't touch it for X amount of time, people are just back to buying capes. Now we have an exclusive news segment on the huge updates that came to old school RuneScape yesterday. And we have Ray from New York to read you the news. It's his very first day as a news anchor for the channel. Let's see how he does on his first day. All right, now, how about those? Uh, you know, I fought, I already, you already made me nervous. Now, how about those big updates from yesterday? First, the price of every single item in the bounty hunter shop has been reduced. Sometimes, some as much by. Bro, you already made me f up. Why are you making me so nervous? Listen, I'm not doing anything in game. I'm just gonna say it. I, I don't know how you expect me to f right click. Listen, read it like you just finished a joint. Cool. Now, how about those big updates from yesterday? First, the price of every single item in the bounty hunter shop has been reduced, some by as much as 50%. If you've already bought the gear, don't worry. 
you can receive a refund at the same store where you bought your loot. Perdue has also been added to the lobby of Damon's Crater for players who can't stop dying. Alongside these updates to Bounty Hunter, many more were proposed, including an earned potential system that would give a little bonus to players who have died several times in a row, or have fought many times without a win. Make sure to check out the blog so you can voice your opinion on the direction of this minigame. Thank you, Ray. He's still working on his YouTube voice, I think. Now I'll take over from here. This week we saw the release of the Forestry Beta. Forestry is a woodcutting expansion that will overhaul the way that we train the skill from the ground up. Hop over to the beta world to earn yourself some anima-infused bark, try out the small variety of random events, and get a feel for the new direction of the skill. Skill Specs runs into an old friend. Hey, yo, f you, Kevin! And the way you're looking at me, bro- Sorry, sorry, sorry. That was mean. I sorry, I hold a little bit of beef. With friends like these, who needs enemies? Yoda cracks a few clues with the boys. Oh my god! Oh, thirty trick! Oh my god! Oh my god. Oh, what the fuck? No way! It. Holy shit! Third age pickaxes are worth well over max cash and are too valuable to be sold in the grand exchange. Enjoy your new max gear, Yoda. Lake continues to boost himself on his hardcore Iron Man. Good luck. Oh shit, we got it. Let's go, man. Well, had to happen at some point, man. Had to happen at some point. At this rate, Lake will be done with Chambers next month. A good PKer comes up with plans almost instantly. We can smite this man's anguish. We can't smite this man's anguish. There's zero we could do in that situation, man. But a great PKer follows through. Better luck next time, Dino. Wow. Wow. That was flawless. That was flawless. That was flawless. That was flawless. Never underestimate your opponent. He's... We're all good. We got this, man. We got this. He doesn't even have any throwing axes. He's just going for the dark bows. If he had throwing axes, I'd be shitting myself. But he is literally just going for the dark bows. Skill Specs finds an Iron Man. Yes. He's an iron man! Oh no, the spec is. Ooh. Ooh! I have to. Wait, what am I doing? Dude, I keep doing that. By accident, I'm not even intentionally doing that. One like 60, he's dead. No way you hit an 80. My hardcore iron man. Completed. No, bro, no, 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 I guess you'll never know what his spec weapon was. He didn't need it. Donator does what he does best. He risked that, didn't he? No, that was not a smite. Don't tell me that was a smite. That was not a smite. That was not my fifth claw smite. We could make an entire video out of Donator's claw smites. This has been another episode of RuneScape Chronicles. Thank you for your support, and we will see you again tomorrow.